Greetings, YouTube. Happy Wednesday. I just got back to my office and opened up the game and saw the Lesser Advanced and Superior Catalyst Bundles. I wanted to talk a little bit about them today. If you're one of those people that clicks on my offer videos, always just waiting for me to be a terrible negative uh, reinforcement of Kabam's trash offers, this video might surprise you because depending on your progression in the game, I actually think some of these bundles, dare I say, hold decent to good value. I don't think anything is July 4th. You better uh, ask your mom for a credit card because you don't want to uh, miss out on the opportunity to get a free five-star awakening gem with the purchase of an Odin. You know, that's the definition of a great or an exceptional offer and uh, and so that's kind of my bar but certainly the bottom of the bar is what we've seen in the past couple of weeks even what we saw yesterday in the offer of uh, the four star generic awakening gem with the daily card that still couldn't even have the generic based five star gems but instead were only class based so let's just uh, let's go back in time for a second and talk about uh, oh probably about march of 2017 about once every month, maybe even once every two months when you played the game, you would get an offer that would pop up like this, and it would be 500 units just for a little bit of gold and one Tier 4 basic. So now we are in May of 2018, and that same offer has been buffed, if you will. It also contains three Tier 3 uh, Class Catalyst Crystals, which for uh, newer players are not the easiest to get, and so that's certainly significant. And then this is really where I think the whales can benefit even from just spending 500 units because each one of uh, the tier one alpha catalyst, which used to be valued at at least one to 200 units, you get five of them. So right there, that's 500 units worth of tier one alphas, which you need five just to rank up a five-star champion from rank two to rank three or rank one to rank two. So that is significant. And then if you need gold, 100,000 gold is also nothing to shy about. So for 500 units in what used to be maybe like 10,000 gold and one tier four basic, that is a very solid offer. I would say out of a 10, 10 being that five-star awakening gem, I'd put this at like a six and a half to a seven. And if you're a player that really needs those tier one alphas to rank up a five-star, obviously that's like an eight or a nine because that's going to immediately help you, uh, especially given that Alliance War Season 2 officially starts today, so you want the best 5 stars available at the highest rank to compete and not have to use units or potions or revives. Now the advanced bundle is an interesting one. So this is more than twice the price of the lesser catalyst bundle, and yet you only get two times the tier 4 basics. I think uh, for the price it would make a lot more sense to have three tier 4 basics in this. But you do replace the Tier 3 class catalyst with one Tier 4 class catalyst, which also used to be really hard to get. I'm talking about like a 2,000 unit offer for one. So it used to be 2,000 for one. Now it's a 1,250 for one with two Tier 4 basics. And the mega reason why so many people will snatch this up, 10 Tier 1 Alpha Catalyst, which again, I put in about 100 units realistically worth of value. So that's 1,000 units worth of value for a Tier 1 Alpha uh, the two tier four basics. The the other thing that I want to make sure I touch on as I scroll down, you have one fourth or twenty five percent of a tier two alpha catalyst fragment. Now we did see the deal that I snatched up last week that I thought was just unbelievably good, and for nine thousand units that got you two fully formed tier two basic catalyst, uh, or excuse me, two tier two tier two alpha catalyst which was the equivalent of 72,000 shards for 9,000 units, plus you got 10,000 five-star crystal shards. So comparing that to this, it's not the best ratio, but you also do double the gold. Again, if you're going to ask for more than double the price and you just double the gold, this should probably be 300,000 gold, not 200,000. So my complaints about this one are that they're asking you to double, uh, more than double the price in order to get the tier four class catalyst and the one fourth or 25% tier two alpha catalyst fragments. Realistically, I think this would be as good of a deal, if not a little bit better, if the price was just doubled to a thousand units, but because it's 1250, I have to realistically put this down a little bit more, especially because they haven't uh, tripled the tier four basic or for that matter, the gold. I'm going to put this at a five and a half to six. 
Of course, if you are someone that is really close to forming a Tier 2 Alpha Catalyst to rank up your champion, you're going to look at this as more like an 8 or a 9, and I completely understand. And, and just as if you really need the gold or you really need those Tier 1 Alphas and you don't have them, the value of it would go up. For, but for the average player, I'd say 5.5 to 6. Now let's go to the Whale Offer, or as they call it, the Superior Catalyst Bundle Offer. Now, this is not four times, but five times the price of the Lesser Catalyst. And yet, once again, we don't even get five times the Tier 4 Basic. We get four instead of one. This should be at five. Now, it's double the price of the Advanced Catalyst, and so they are doubling the Tier 4 Class Catalyst. From a math perspective, I guess that makes sense. The Tier 1 Alpha Catalyst don't double, though. They only go to 15. This one, not that you would want them because they'd immediately go into your overflow, but for 15 Tier 1 Alpha Catalysts, I think this should be at 20. If you're going to give me 10 for 1250, why not 20 for 2500? That's the minimal uh, value that you're giving me in the middle tier. So that, that one's disappointing. The only thing that truly doubles is the Tier 2 Alpha Catalyst Fragment, which is 18,000 or half of a Tier 2 Alpha Catalyst instead of the 9,000. And then the gold you do get the five times value of the lesser from 100 to 500,000. But again, I, I think this one is really missing the mark. If you're going to pay five times the price of the lesser catalyst bundle, I would expect to get at least five times the amount of rewards. I'd expect to get five tier four basic catalysts. I would expect to at least get three tier four class catalysts. I would expect to get 20 tier one alpha catalysts. And I, I guess 18,000 is a fair expectation given the 1250, but you know, something like... Uh, Oh, 27,000 would probably be better. And then you look at the gold. Why not a million gold? Why not just uh, just make it really enticing? So this one, given the almost uh, deflation of value, I would put at a four and a half to five. It is a very average offer given the state of the game to give almost an Odin's or $100 worth of units for something that doesn't match the natural progression of the other two offers. So in review, I actually think most people, regardless of where you are at the game, should probably pick up this 500 unit one if you have 500 units to spare. Because... If nothing else, the Tier 1 Alpha Catalyst will give you the ability to immediately rank up to Rank 1 to Rank 2 or Rank 2 to Rank 3, a 5-star champion in the game. Now, in that middle tier, it's really going to depend on your progression, if you're close to forming a Tier 2 Alpha Catalyst, or certainly if you need a specific class catalyst, that one might be advantageous to you. And then the Spear Catalyst Bundle or the Whale Offer, I really think is just a very average value. But I understand if you just opened, say, a 5-star a god tier champion like a Hyperion, for example, and you have no tier one alpha catalyst, basically you would buy this offer and you would have enough tier one alphas to immediately rank them up. But that would also be assuming that you have far more tier four basics because you only get four and that is not anywhere close to enough to go from rank one to rank three. So that's my feedback. I hope that helps. Certainly, uh, again, it depends on where you are progression wise in the game. But overall, if you have 500 units to spare, you really won't regret getting the gold, the tier 1 alphas, or that uh, one basic. And uh, from there, it'll just depend on how close you are to the tier 2 alpha shards. And also, if you're one or two uh, tier 4 class catalyst away from forming, say, three in order to rank five a four-star champion. Thanks for watching, YouTube, and good luck in the game.